we're going to be doing our studio tour, which I know so many of you guys have been waiting for. And we finally just finished the last little piece of our studio. And it is here, right behind us, Ta -da! right now. So we are going to just go show you all of our studio right now. Yes. Let's get started. Really quick, this is Cute Girls Hairstyle Studio on the other half of the room. Ta-da! Just a brief overview of the studio. Okay, so the next part of our studio, we like to call this like the DIY area because this is like where we have all of our DIY stuff because we have this wonderful white table from mm -hmm. Ikea. And it actually is pretty legit because it has these like legs that you can like adjust based upon your height. Mm -hmm. so, so Bailey and I have them all the way down because we're so short. <laughs> the table has to be shorter than I am. <laughs> and we have this like wonderful blue cart. Can you see it over here? It actually holds a lot of stuff. It's so it's helpful. It's got a glue stick in here. Like just like random stuff that we need all the time. And the miscellaneous drawer. The miscellaneous. It's like a little, I don't know. I, it, I feel like, you know, back in those old days when they cart around those candies in the hospital. like with one What? Of those I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> I feel like this is like one of those like candy carts. <laughs> Found slash made. Found slash made slash bought from a bunch of different stores and fun stuff. Like we made these out of soup cans and then we just put the little, uh, what is it called? The like label, chalk, the chalk label. Chalk label thing on it. Colored pencils and sharpies and then we've got a beautiful yarn ball. And then I'll show you my favorite part of the studio. <laughs> <laughs> this jar right here is full of, mm, what color is this? Bright blue sugary gumballs mm. so that anytime we're up here we steal one and it's quite handy so if you're hungry yeah and, and then that see that ram's horn skull up there my we went and shopped at this antique skull. store it's a legit skull. yeah we went and got went to this antique store and like my mom and I found it and we thought it'd be so unique and cool to have in the studio, but my dad was like, no, that's creepy. I don't know how many but I think I Oh my goodness, it's not that scary. It's just a skull. Okay, maybe that's a little scary, <laughs> but <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> okay, and then I'll show you another little trick that you guys keep on the down low. But up here, I mean this jar right here is Now I know that. Well, now she knows that. Sometimes but I do eat that quite often. I'm very in love with sugar. And then we just have our other jars and our little plants and our pictures over here. And we actually got these shelves from Pottery Barn and my dad had to hang them up for us because I don't know how to do that. And then the rest of this stuff up here, we made these and we got these from Pottery Barn as well. We just hurt herself. Show them their wounds. <laughs> Wait, wait, you moved it before the camera could focus. Ooh, that looks like a bad one. Yucky. I smashed my finger on the light. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to kiss it better for you, Brooklyn? No, I think I'm okay. Thanks, <laughs> though. <laughs> the next part of our studio that we're going to show you, and this is what we call the B wall, which is pretty self explanatory considering. It's a wall full of bees, and in case you are wondering, which I certainly hope you figured this out, but the bees stand for Brooklyn and Bailey, because that's what our names start with. So we found all of these bees from a mixture of antique stores, Hobby Lobby, or just crafts that we made with our friend jo Jenny from Show Me Cute. And then we have this bed here, which is kind of might seem strange to y'all. Why on earth do you have a bed in your studio? <sighs> But it makes a really good background for color, and color is great in the video. And also, it works if you get really tired because you're making sleep. And it's super fun to just dress up for the holidays. As you can see, the heart is for Valentine's Day because that's coming up. Do you see this beautiful view? It's like a bookshelf, you know? You think that's where books are, but no. No. Dun no. da dun. Oh, 
Yeah. Gasp, you see these bookshelf rooms and movies. Yeah, and now we have now one. We Check it out. Check it. Check it out in here. Dun, 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 dun. Mom wants this to be a storage room, but I want it as my bedroom. It's like so awesome. I in want here. it as my bedroom. I do. I want it. This is this is basically where we just put all of our camera supplies when we're not using it. Mm -hmm. So that the studio doesn't look very messy because sometimes when we leave the camera stuff out, I can get pretty messy. There's a bunch of stuff back there. Why don't you tell them what the stuff is? Oh, let's see. This is our tripod with our Canon camera. This one's a 7D if for those of you who have cameras. And then this is just our softbox. Got it on Amazon. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool stuff. This is our taller tripod with our other camera. This one's a 5D for those of you who know cameras. And our other twin softbox over here. And then a bunch of our mics and other <laughs> joyful things that dad does and I don't know what they are. Yeah. <laughs> that I'm gonna be showing you is called the sitting room because we have this couch which came from a place called World Market and everything on this couch came from Pottery Barn so we have this blanket and then Felicia the cat and then this pillow all of it is from Pottery Barn and then if you guys do remember this is where we sat when we showed you guys how to make the, this heart last week on our other video so if you guys want to figure out how to do that we have a video on how to make this lovely heart and then this is my absolute favorite part which I'm pretty sure we mentioned last week as well. His name is Arnold. This is our unicorn. And my friend Trevor actually named him Arnold last time he came and visited. And it's just stuck ever since. So here is Arnold. And then over here we have this hashtag. And then we have this ugly doll frame. And then we have this antique alarm clock. And this antique, uh, what's this called? Like a nightstand? Table. This antique table. Yes. Thank you guys so much for watching our studio tour. I hope you guys enjoyed this mm -hmm. as much as I did. And I also hope you guys can convince my parents to turn this she into my bedroom. She wants it really bad. They want it really bad. Please, please, please. And this is my room. I want this in my room. It's so cute. And then I can have my own room. Yes. Seriously, <laughs> I want my own room. I mean, come on. I like sharing, but you know, yeah. whatever. Be sure to comment below on your favorite part of the studio mm -hmm. tour. And we'll see y'all next week. Bye. Bye. Cookies on a